Oh, I am. He robbed us from our parents, and he gave us back to ourselves. The truth has not been in your courtroom. Never has been in your courtroom. All you have is confusion in your courtroom. Why do I have to stand and take the blame for your sins again? I spent my life in jail, paying for you, so that you could ride your bicycle, have your birthday parties, have what you'd call a life. You know, I never had a life. I don't even know what life is, you know. I go to the desert, I'm not even allowed to live in your desert. I'm no good for anything except to be you. Is your scapegoat. I'm used every day of my life. I've been used. And I haven't been used, and I have been on the on the street. I've been chased, run, harassed, pushed, kicked. My ribs have been broken, you know. The same man that gives you a traffic ticket is the same guy that knocks my brains out. He figures just because he is the man, he can get away with it because nobody's going to say anything. My daddy's not a congressman, a doctor, or a lawyer. They are sneaking in the county jail, looking under the door to see if the man is there. Sneaking like little children out of town. <laughs> sneaking, <laughs> sneaking all around the courthouse. Sneaking in and out of the ventilators, sneaking everywhere. Everything is sneaky up around Sneakyville. <laughs> Everything we have to do is, is to get to the truth has to be sneaky. It seems a shame to sneak to get to the truth. To make the truth such an evil, dirty, old, nasty thing. You gotta sneak to get to the truth. The truth is condemned. The truth is in the gas chamber. The truth has been in your stockyards, your slaughterhouses. The truth has been in your reservation, building your railroads, emptying your garbage. The truth is in your ghettos, in your jails. Your young love, not in your courts or your congress, where the old sit judgment on the young. What the hell do the old know about the young? They put a picture of old George on a dollar and tell you that he's your father worshiping. Look at the madness that goes on. You can't prove anything that happened yesterday. Now is the only thing that's real. You can try to prove that Columbus sailed on an ocean, but it's not the same ocean. It's a different ocean. It's a different world. Every day, every reality is a new reality. Every new reality is a is a new horizon. A brand new experience of living. I got a note last night from a friend of mine. He writes in this note that he's afraid of what he might have to do in order to save his reality, as I save mine. You can't prove anything. There's nothing to prove. Every man judges himself. He knows what he is. You know what you are, as I know what I am. We all know what we are. Nobody can stand in judgment. They can play like they're standing in judgment. They can play like they stand in judgment and take you off and control the masses with your human body. And they can lock you up and gun and and cages and put you on crosses as they did in the past. But it doesn't amount to anything. What they're doing is they're only persecuting a reflection of themselves. They're persecuting what they can't stand to look at in themselves. The truth. They can't stand to look at the truth in themselves. They persecute themselves. They're persecuting themselves every time they go on the freeway. They hate themselves. Look at the sign. Stop. Go. Turn here. Turn there. You can't do this. You can't do that. You can't. You can't. You can't. This is illegal. That's illegal. Everything.
Thank you.